Hello, I'm Richard, owner, brewer at Penguin City Brewing Company. We went with Deutsche Beverage for our system. Follow me and check it out. All right, here's the backside of the brew house. So we have a, our, our 20 barrel brew house here and integrated is the three and a half barrel system. Uh, it's really cool because it uses the same HLT, CLT. You can see in the hopper, you can divert it to go to either one. Got our small uh, three and a half barrel fermenters for pilot batches. All of our other vessels are 60 barrels. So we'll do three turns typically to get into one. So there's some key features that I really like about the system. One is the, uh, the blending valve that will blend CLT and HLT together. You just dial in that number and it sends it. And also with the uh, flow meters, you just tell it how much and it does it. It's really, really convenient. And there's an auto knockout feature for knocking out that uh, very recently it's upgraded to, uh, it added the, the flow rate to the parameters you can set, which really helps with hydrostatic pressure in the auto knockout when you're going in with your second and third turns. It's uh, very close to a set it and forget it and you get within a degree of your desired temperature. Fantastic. This is a big one too. Having the super sacks, uh, just dial in that number and it sends it instead of ripping open 50, <laughs> a ridiculous amount of bags and uh, breaking your back and everything, cutting stuff open. This is a key feature that is helping me not be terribly sore every day. Uh, and another thing I really, really like, uh, the fact that the bright tanks do have two separate ports on the bottom, one for packaging, the one and a half inch. It's about, it's got a built-in standpipe, permanent standpipe. Uh, it's about a barrel. So you never have to worry about pulling out anything you don't want in your finished product. Uh, and it's got the two inch drain port right in the center. Uh, another really cool feature that helps us stay consistent is the uh, the carbonation module where you've got a solenoid valve right here for your inlet you've got a little flow meter here so you set your flow get those bubbles just how you want them um, and the uh, the prv at top has another solenoid valve that you could set so you set those maybe within one psi of each other and when that's done it shuts off and you should be really really close to the exact carbonation you want